there any way that they can leverage AI to help with the review process? I mean, that's, I wouldn't even know how to answer and that And again, question. then we're thinking of the legitimacy of how good is AI knowing what yeah, it is I, I or think not. But there, I guess I mean, I'm just thinking of like, what's a way to expedite and streamline the process that makes sure the right people advance to the next stage? Well, I mean, I don't know. I don't see logistically how that team can review every single video that they receive of every workout in that time frame. I just don't like I think that's nearly impossible. And you can't push semifinals back that yeah. far because you need the admin time on the back end for drug right. testing, mm -hmm. drug jerseys, testing. appeals, appeals uh, like we hear about drug testing coming in you know, late and people getting last minute backfill invites from semifinals like weeks. A before. week before the game. Yeah. And, and, you know, the games are, I think, technically about a week later, but still you need that time. And if you want athletes to be able to, you know, properly prepare for these, these, the big spectacle in the showcase, you're going to need that gap to, to wind down from semifinals and build back up. And I, that, that is quarterfinals judging is the most hotly contested aspect of the season every single year mm -hmm. and rightfully so and it is also the biggest stress point stressor internally for crossfit's team yes and i this just seems to amplify it now yeah i don't think the the 25 percent increase in force qualifying for quarterfinals for individuals and teams necessarily uh, makes a difference as much because you're still only right. you're still only like you, you still only have to validate so far down the leaderboard. Yes, I would. And and look, a lot of people. I mean, I just speaking for me. If I made it that far, I'm not. Come on, I'm not doing videos. I'm like, and so I should not. I won't be eligible to go, and that's fine. So I, like it's, I, I think it's it's safe to assume that not everybody who participates will be sending videos. There and there's going to have to be, I think. Uh, a much harder line drawn for a lot of that stuff. Well, like, if, like if I, you don't submit submit a video from the outset, 